Dear Sri Chaitanya family, we all had experienced shock and pain this past week. We have lost our founder, guide and an extraordinary human being. How our mind gets used to the unimaginable, even if we can't accept that's life. I have never imagined a life without my father. He has always loved us all so completely, especially his grandchildren and how much he loved my mom. I would like to share a few things about my dad, whom all of you adore, revere and respect. He was a man of great sensitivity, empathy, drive and affection, guided by a strong moral compass. He was an introvert who never shared his pain, but instead tried to spread joy with his warm smile. He was an amazing listener. One of his classic greeting was Bhavnara Master. My dad was my first hero and my first love. There was no better man. However, these past few days made me realize that he is a larger hero than I had thought. Thousands of people have showered so much love and shared how much he meant to them. It's truly touching. He was a man who treated every person by merit rather than stature or designation. My dad was a man of simple pleasures. He loved his cigarette and coffee, tea. He loved mango pickles so much that he had it every day. A good mutton curry, fish fry, jalebi and ice cream and movies. He loved films with strong emotion and complexity. And ever while his baby, Sri Chaitanya. He enjoyed so much being in the campus, spending time with students. He liked motivating students and he was so very good at it. My dad lived a full life of meaning and purpose, given us all a path to follow and add meaning to our lives. For the past several years, he has been a silent force behind us, quietly guiding us and challenging us. He firmly believed that a life without productivity is not worth living, and he went out on his own terms with a historic result and an expanding empire. He walked away with his head held high without depending on anyone. He will live in our hearts and minds forever. When me and my sister moved back to India to be a part of his legacy, he gave us independence to find our ground and build his organization to the best we can and serve millions of students every year. He was never controlling and believed in nurturing leaders for the future. It's a rare quality in a successful man. Let us continue to work hard with twice the energy and thrive under his divine guidance. I am sure we will be much stronger now as a team with his superpowers and cosmic energy leading us. He has come from nowhere and created an identity for himself and enabled for all of us to have an identity too. He along with my mom have helped transform countless lives with Narendra Garu by their side. They had an inseparable bond which continues. He would want us to focus on work rather than feel sorry. He would want us to help students rather than feel sad. You have all given him the best parting gift. He was proud of all of you for achieving the impossible with three All India First ranks, and he rode off into the wilderness with an all-time high performance. Thank you for collaborating and reaching that important milestone. We are a team, and we shall get through this with dignity and purpose. We are always here for you. I kindly request all staff members to resume their duties and return to work. Each one of you play a crucial role in the smooth functioning of our institution and your dedication is vital in upholding the standards of excellence that we have set for Sri Chaitanya. Let us carry forward his legacy. Thank you so much.